Last week, I had you write an essay about the things that you liked the most. This week, I thought it might be fun if we wrote an essay about the things that we disliked the most. Solomon? Yes, ma'am. Can you think of something that you dislike? Being a nigger. How do you mean nothing bad? The teacher asked the question, and I just answered it. Well, why'd you say it? Because it's the truth. If and I was white, my pa still be alive. Being a nigga killed my pa. You answer me something, sir. Yeah, if I can. Would you like to live to be a hundred? Yeah, sure, I would. It's not very likely, but I guess all of us like to live to a ripe old age. Would you rather be black and live to be a hundred, or white and live to be fifty? It's amazing, wherever that abides in the human being, there is the nobleness of the human spirit, despite it all, black and white, Asian, Spanish, Native American, pretty, plain, thin, fat, vowed a celibate, we rise. You may write me down in history with your bitter, twisted lies. You may trod me in the very dirt, but still like dust, I'll rise. Does my sassiness upset you? Why are you beset with gloom? Just cause I walk as if I have oil wells pumping in my living room. Just like suns and like moons with the certainty of tides. Just like hope springing high. Still I rise. Did you want to see me broken? Bowed head and lowered eyes. Shoulders falling down like teardrops. Weakened by my soulful cries, does my sassiness upset you? <laughs> Don't take it so hard just because I laugh. <laughs> As if I have gold mines digging in my own backyard. You can shoot me with your words. You can cut me with your lies. You can kill me with your hatefulness. But just like life, I'll rise. Does my sexiness offend you? Oh, does it come as a surprise that I dance as if I have diamonds at the meeting of my thighs? Out of the huts of history's shame, I rise. Up from a past rooted in pain, I rise. A black ocean leaping and wide, welling and swelling, I bear in the tide. Leaving behind nights of terror and fear, I rise. Into a daybreak miraculously clear, I rise. Bringing the gifts that my ancestors gave, I am the hope and the dream of the slave. And so, naturally, there I go rise.